hi friends welcome back to the channel i hope each and every one of you guys are doing well today listen i have this um song message for you guys that i believe that you'll you'll enjoy because tis the season okay tis the season we're in so one day i was listening to rudolph the red-nosed reindeer and it just hit differently i was like <gasps> and god gave me a message okay so let's talk about it let's talk about it let's go through these lyrics okay it says rudolph the red-nosed reindeer had a very shiny nose and if you ever saw it you would even say it glows all of the other reindeer used to laugh and call him names they never let poor rudolph join in any reindeer games then one foggy christmas eve santa came to say rudolph with your nose so bright won't you guide my sleigh tonight then how the reindeer loved him as they shouted out with glee, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, you will go down in history. All right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, do you know where we're going? Where are we going with this? Where are we going with the song, Nadisha? Where are we going with the song? We're going with the song. We're going places with this song, okay? So yes, I know this is like, um, this is fiction and, you know, uh, santa claus isn't real and all of that but it doesn't matter there's still a message here okay so here's rudolph you know he had this red nose that people make fun of apparently you know like what's wrong with being different you know you know but people hate differences in our world okay so i know um for many of you guys you've always been different you've always felt different you never fit in with other uh people you know you just you were just always basically the outcast you know you always felt ostracized right you just never fit in you know you always felt rejected you always felt like thrown to the side right right so and whenever <laughs> there was any games to be played you were the last to be picked because nobody wanted you on their teams right but be somebody had to put you on the team Okay, but you were the last pick, you know, a lot of you guys felt like you were that person. A lot of you guys might have felt like Rudolph, right? You know, excluded, segregated, dismissed, belittled, all of that, right? Simply because you were different, you know, it could have been something on you that made you different but a lot of times it is not what's on you what is what's in you it's the God in you that made you different right but you best believe you know God has a way he saw the whole thing he saw you before before um, when you were in your mother's room um, he, he, he he formed you right he saw you from from back then okay so he's been watching your whole progress through life it wasn't like oh gosh when did you turn 18 no, 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 no. God is well aware. God, your angels, is well aware of your progress throughout life, okay? He saw the hatred. He saw the discrimination. He saw the madness. He saw the segregation. He saw the ostracization. He saw all of that. He saw the rejection that people that people um, did to you, okay? He saw all of that. So it's not like he's confused or he's lost in the whole process, okay? And that's why God always have a way, you know? In the scripture, it says God uses the simple things of this world to confound the wise. That's one of my favorite scripture. He uses the simple things of this world to confound, confound the wise, all right? And then just like um, in Psalms... You know, in Psalms 118, it says the stone the builders rejected has become the capstone. The Lord has done this and it's marvelous in our eyes. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Okay. They rejected Rudolph. Okay. They rejected him. Okay. They made fun of him. They called him names. All of that. Okay. But God has a way to make your gifts. God has a way to allow your gifts to make room for you. Okay. The very thing that people made fun of you about is the very thing that God will use to bring fame to you. You know, even if you don't even desire fame, that is the very thing that God will use for your success, to bring income your way. 
for a career, okay? The very thing that people just laughed at and just kind of was like, ah, you're a joke, blah, blah, blah. God has a way of doing that, okay? I, I think there was this model. I think one of the things that she hated about herself was her big lips. And it turned out that now she's this famous model and the lips is it. It, it is what got her to where she she is right now okay so it's it's usually the things that people reject about you God will use for your glory okay okay God will use to rise you up God will use to build you up all right so just like it is with Rudolph they rejected him okay and then you know God will send somebody your way okay this in this case it was Santa Claus that man is a big deal Santa Claus is a big deal, okay? Who doesn't want to work for Santa Claus? <laughs> you know, so of all the people, Santa Claus is like, oh, wait, you know, it's foggy, I need light. And he looking around and Rudolph was it, okay? The whole time he's always been in the back. The first shall be last and the last shall be first. I'm telling you, the whole time he was in the back, overlooked, underpaid, you know, just just thrown to the side okay locked up like cinderella but one day when it's time hallelujah when it's time when, when god says it's time when god says it's time your gifts your talents will make room for you just like joseph okay joseph was in prison and somebody was like wait hold up yeah i know a guy i know a guy who knows how to interpret dreams Okay, and they went to go get Joseph from the prison. Okay, your gifts will make room for you. All right, don't don't dismiss your gifts. Don't dismiss your talents. Every time you get a talent, your giftings, it is what God will use to bring income your way. It is it is it is how you're going to make your living. Your gifts. All right. So here it was. It was his time. It was his time. It was his time and it, it was his literal time to shine, okay? His nose uh, lit the way, okay? And it was his time to shine. And the part that I really truly hate, truly hate this part, is uh, then how the reindeer loved him. I'd be like, listen, man, you need to keep that energy, okay? <laughs> you need to stay, stay away from me okay you didn't like me before now you like me now because i'm working for santa claus now because i'm leading the way now because i'm in front you didn't like me when i was in the back how come how come you didn't talk to me when i was in the back how come you didn't even look my way when i was in the back now you like me because because i'm a big deal <laughs> stay away from me okay but nevertheless keep your heart pure guys keep your heart pure he he went down in history he went down in history. Some of you guys, listen, <clears throat> I keep talking about famous fame and um, celebrity status and all that. And I'm telling you, a lot of God's people have zero desire for this. Zero. This is not even really a dream or anything for many of you guys. But God desire it for you. God desire it for you. Some of you guys will be famous okay you already know this is, i'm not i am not telling you anything that god hasn't already put placed within you a lot of a lot of you guys know what i'm talking about okay you're gonna go down in history you're going to leave your mark on this planet okay you're going to leave a legacy on this planet doing god's work doing god's work you're going to leave a legacy on this planet you best believe it okay god has a way of taking the nobodies, taking the, the cornerstones that the builders rejected. He has a way because he's seen the mess. He's seen the, he has seen the madness throughout your whole life. He has a way of pulling the nobodies from the back and just pushing them to the forefront. He has a way to do this. There comes a time where it will be your time to shine. There comes a time where it will be your time to shine and show the world who you have always been, who you've always been, okay? So in this case, it was, um, it was, it was Rudolph, okay? In, in the, you know, for you guys, you know who you are. It will be you, friend. It will be you. Your time is coming. Your time where God is going to move you from the back to the front 
is coming. Trust and believe that God is behind the scenes, working it out and making a way for you. Your gifts, friend, will make room for you. Trust and believe that. All right, friends. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for liking the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Talk to you soon.